Also tonight, the Gaffney community and the Cherokee County School District mourning the loss of a 14 year old student after he accidentally shot himself over the weekend. The Cherokee County Coroner's Office called the death of Zacchaeus Davis a quote, absolute tragic event. Yeah, it certainly is. Fox Carolina Zach Volotsky spoke with the district superintendent tonight and joins us live in studio with more. Tori and Justin, Superintendent Dr. Dana Falls says the entire Cherokee County School District community is keeping the family of Zacchaeus Davis in their thoughts and prayers. They also made grief counselors available to students and staff today who were in need. Now, the Cherokee County Coroner says Davis and his 13-year-old cousin were at the home of their assistant basketball coach when Davis found a gun in a kitchen cabinet and began playing with it while singing. The coroner says Davis reportedly pressed that gun against his chest when it accidentally fired. The teen died at the scene. His death is being ruled accidental. Davis was a student at Gaffney High School. Superintendent Falls says the person whose house Davis was at was his coach through an AAU basketball team that is not associated with the district, but he adds that that person is a teacher at the Cherokee County School District. Now, the Cherokee County School Board met tonight for the first time since this tragic event over the weekend and began their meeting with a moment of silence for Davis. Just a tragic, unfortunate event. Um, our, our thoughts and prayers go out to the families and everybody involved with the situation, our school families. Um, we've had counselors out at all the schools uh, making sure that our employees and our kids are taken care of. So right now it's still fresh and, and I just, you know, respecting the family, I, I hope that everyone just kind of respects them and just keeps them in their thoughts and prayers. Now, officers with the Gaffney Police Department say they will decide this week if any charges should be filed again in this tragic accident. Now, Superintendent Fall would not say which school that teacher works at or if that person is still teaching while Gaffney Police investigate. Tori.